With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, the question is Lieberman, uh, Lieberman nitrosote reaction. So what is Lieberman nitrosote reaction? So otherwise we can say Lieberman test as well. So in that, we test for the nitro, uh, nitrosote we used for the phenol. This is a test of phenol. So if phenol is reacted with HNO2, okay. So HNO2, so it will convert. First of all, how this HNO2 is formed? Generally, we used, generally you use NNS2 with H2SO4. So from there, it will form HNO2, mean in acidic medium, okay. And with that, here it will form as a Na2SO4. So this HNO2 will react with this phenol and from here the electrophile will form as NO because acid is already present and this is, will be act as a base. So acid base reaction will take place. So not this one, this one acid. This acid and this it will be act as a base. So from here NO will be formed as a electrophile and that electrophile will be added in the para position because here the major product will be formed. We can add in the ortho also but ortho will be the minor product. So after that, one more phenol will come in acidic medium. Here, one more phenol will form or come in acidic medium and it will react with this nitro comp uh, nitroso compound. So it will convert into something like this. So it will convert. Here, phenol is present. Here, nitrogen is present. And this nitrogen will be connected by double bond with this benzene. And this benzene will be convert something like this. Here, double bond. And here we have double bond O. And after that, we will use base, base as a NOH. Okay. So after that, we will use a here NaOH as a base. So it will convert this as a where. Okay. One more thing here we have this OH group that we have taken here OH group. This OH is also present here. So that OH will be present here. So that OH will react with this NOH. So here phenoxide ion will form this phenoxide ion. And after reacting with this base, if phenol is present and if it is reacting with HNO2, H positive, again phenol is present in the same compound and after using base, so this color, the solid, the compound that we are getting here, the color of that compound will be blue. So here we have N double bond, after that here we have this ring and in that ring we have two double bond, okay, and double bond O. The color of this compound will be blue, blue color. Okay, so one more thing that one compound that we get here, this one, the color of this compound also we can show this color of this compound will be either red or brown, red brown color we will get. So overall, the uh, Lieberman test that we can uh, we can summarize as when phenol is reacting with this. Let's suppose any compound is present that the compound is reacting with HNO2 so that form this nitroso compound and that nitroso compound again reacting with the phenol. So red or brown color compound is formed and that red brown compound if again reacting with NOS so blue color compound is formed. And if these two colors are showing so that means here the phenol is present so that is called as a uh, we can say as a test of phenol. So I hope you understand the whole concept. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.